We're moving on into the loser side. That's true. I'm, I'm not move, making it we're up. Moving on. We're moving, moving on. on. It's going to be Alex Myers and Enzo the Hokage. <laughs> Yeah. So uh, look at the ages. They're backwards. What is this digitry going on here? 31 years old for Alex Myers, who I recall <laughs> when he was a teenager, showed up to Super Arcade with homework. Do you remember that? He was in high school still. He would go to Wednesday Night Fights with homework. And, uh, I remember uh, him bringing there. like a giant notepad, but I thought it was just like his notes for the he, game. He did also have that, but he legit had to do homework there sometimes. So I remember him of that age. Now he's 31. Meanwhile, Enzo, 13 years old, hasn't even taken a picture in his life yet. Not amazing, yet. amazing. Yet. Doesn't even own a smartphone. No way to get a hold of that. And uh, here he is, <laughs> Enzo. Uh, again, very, very strong up and coming player. I've played him in tournament as well. He, it's not just that he's sort of a flash in the pan or, or a kind of player who has one strength or not. He is a, he's, he's very strong mentally He's beaten me in reverse 3-0 situations, even. Like, he's he's very, he's super already ready for moments like that, even on top of having, you know, the combos and the sort of neutral game. Sure. He, he's mentally very strong already. I think he's got a great future. He has won already some strong online tournaments, mm -hmm. some locals, big up-and-coming guy. Yeah. I think that what's most impressive is his stat towards uh, adapting to whatever is thrown at him. He's had such a wide array of different difficulty levels, both online and offline. He's faced off against like a, a stellar level against like a Chris G. He's faced off against people that are kind of wild over in pools sometimes, and he's he's learned how to like transcend against that. Yeah. His his switch between like knowing when to go like all in and be very very patient and kind of study the player is is above average in comparison to For a sure. lot of the like the, totally, the, totally the players agree. right now. Yeah. Yep. There you go. Alex and Enzo, let's get into it. Chun-Li, of course, for Alex. When the game first came out, he went to Chun, and he wasn't sure that he was going to stick with her, but obviously he has, and I think that's been the right call. And I, I don't know why. I've had so many talks with him at the yeah. very beginning, like when we had like the demos of Street Fighter Six during like the very, very final stages of Street Fighter Five. I'm like, just understand, this kit on this character and the way that this game is about to be played is very good. Yeah. Please stick with this guy. Yeah, yeah. Glad he did. I am as well. It, it very much so suits the way he wants to play. Uh, he can be kind of like mix-up heavy as well. But overall, his control, I think his, his fundamentals are top-notch. Oh, yeah. Just like that, it's a big side switch. Never mind. Or so you thought. Well, Alex it, shutting down as well. It's still the same side. Yeah, it's true. just now we're mid-screen. Your turn is over. Oh, boy. Just like that, it's completely the other side. Damn, that over here was fun. Oh, Dude, that man. is relentless looking pressure. Did you see how far that pressure started? Like, off the light kick as well, into like stance, light kick again, yeah. back to back counter hits. There is certain ranges where you're just not going to be able to contest against Chun Li. All right, Enzo. Oh. Put himself at the right spot, was able to react in time. Maybe overextended just a little bit. Alex, again, again? again? Are you going to reset? Okay. We're gonna be looking for a reset over him eventually, right? Because that's just the thing he's been doing so many times already against Enzo. Enzo knows to block. No! Oh, counter hit conversion! Wow. Level Alex. three! Dear God! Killer. Just relentlessly pursued. One side of the stage to the other, back to mid screen. But even so, like the pressure from Chun Li, I don't know what it is about this character that makes a lot of like top players crack. Even seeing like three lights, you're so tempted to want to press a button before the third light comes out. That being a counter hit, plus enough to get the link into crouch medium. Sure. That's disgusting. It's very good. <laughs> it's pretty good. Yeah. All right, Enzo, see if you can control the corner. The leads against the. Oi! Yes, nice. I wonder if that was supposed to have been wake up drive reversal. Have you gotten drive impact on wake up instead of drive reversal? Yes, sir. I Guilt sure have. A Guilt million times. Guilty as charged, yeah. A thousand percent. Yeah, I don't even want to try to time it anymore. Like, I'll. I'll you know, you can just hold it. I'll tell myself, you know what? If I'm going to commit to it, I'm just going to hold it. Yeah. Yeah, you can just hold it. Mm -hmm. I didn't know that until a few days ago. My uh, rate of doing accidental DIs is now zero. Didn't we talk about this? I, I swear don't we talked about Did this we? Like, a, like a week ago. <sighs> Man. But yeah, no, I. That's, that's something I've been telling a lot of folks. I'm like, yeah, just, just hold it. You'll be all right. You do get the corner carry as well. Safe jump. There was a counter hit. You saw oh. empty jump low. That has been a very, like, dominant strategy for a lot of the Japanese players as well. I don't Dude. know if you noticed lately. He is running through this. Oh, I thought he was going to kill. 
saves the bar. Enzo has his chance. That was a pretty close one. Thorito was going to do it, but yeah, I was actually kind of... I don't know if Myers... Yeah, Myers is not in But yeah, after the, the step kick, I'm pretty sure he was within range to hit. Interesting. Oh! oh! The fireball comes out of his DP errantly. And Alex makes him pay with corner with already 40% lost. Oh, he went for Crushing Fierce again. Yeah, he wanted a big stolen turn right there. Why you do? Oh, jeez. Oh, let's go. That was sick, actually. Grounded. That was just kind of wild. I love that. Both of them pumping DP. Hey, you can only get away with it for so long. For the record, he's had it four times before this moment, right? Alex, if he finds one hit, he can do it. Enzo knows that. Oh, oh. No? Okay. He didn't believe that he could dump all the way through. Got him. Uh, again, the exact same sequence that caused Enzo Hokage game number one. Finds himself short and gets the jabs once again. Bam. Solo 10 Lanka. Again, that relentless pressure. To Alex, when he finds it, he just turns it on. I think there was really good tracking on Alex Myers being able to sniff off the jump and uh, punish accordingly. It wasn't it wasn't actually a punish counter. It was like a just counter hit. Enzo Hokage. Enzo the Hokage. Uh, going for that jump in the first place. Little questionable, right? I like the idea of that as his last name. Mr. Hokage? Just Enzo Hokage. Alex Here comes Alex. <laughs> <laughs> Out of the cave. I really oh. enjoy that side switch, by the way. Yeah. Really convenient. The first time I've seen that was from uh, Batty Pot. Former NorCal, now in Japan. Really, really convenient for Chun-Li players. To to Twice you thought you could get away with murder yet again, Alex Myers. Getting shut down by Enzo this time around. Is that lava? Or is that just like red water? I, I, you know, I've blood? never seen lava move like that. Yeah, me neither. My, my mistake. But there is, there is a volcano behind him. I know. Maybe it's blood. Ew. Is it harder to believe that it's blood yes. than that it's like really liquid lava? Uh, I think it's tough for both. Yeah, I think either one's probably very likely. It's probably just Gatorade or something. Nah, it's, it's gotta be like Hawaiian Punch. No whiff punish on the big fierce left out there. Oh. Neither one wants to overcommit, you can tell. Yet Man, both of them have! A, a both of them have! Oh no! Multiple fierces. That's like the biggest thing that most players look for on every stream. Every highlighted clip, it's always, yeah, throw a big button. Right. Welp, okay. Enzo cracked a little bit by being the one to jump. Alex had the Overhead. Enter the very late one, too. We're going to see it again, right? He's trying to keep the mix-ups going. He'd rather not spend level three, I'm sure. We've seen that from him multiple times already. The handshake of destiny. Oh! oh. It's got to be more than that. No, oh. it's match point Alex. Bit of a scramble round. Yeah, the decision-making whether or not to jump out all the, all the, all the meter from Myers was kind of tricky, okay. but this is also another big decision, hitting them right back in the face. Alex Myers going for the immediate DP again. He's just going to have full drive gauge to do what he will. See so what he wants to spend. Okay. Alex, back to the wall, back to the cave. I like this. Right in the pocket, too. Enzo doesn't want to overextend. Wow. That's rough. Oh! <laughs> oh, boy, these big whiffs. Enzo, looking good. He went Except in. He puts himself in the corner. I'm very surprised to see that. Oh no, oh. boy! We totally did. I'm sorry. That was a rock hit. That was indeed a punish counter. He doesn't have any bars to his name. Hence the intentional drop. Myers. I don't know what's going on right now, but oh, does he kill here? Absolutely, he does. With very minimal scaling involved too. By the time that third hit of the uh, lightning legs hit, he was already in yellow. Yikes! That round melted so fast for Enzo. I told you there was gonna be a reset somewhere. Yeah. I just totally forgot it was at the end. <laughs> you were very much right. But I mean, like, Enzo had so much control. And then the moment where he had very little drive gauge left, he made the decision to, to corner himself. Yeah, off of a, uh, yeah. Bank it on, like, the big cross-up, attempt cross-up. I mean, we've talked a lot about him and his mental fortitude, which I think is very, very strong for somebody who's 13 years old. Nevertheless, 13. And I think in the future, that's not the kind of decision that he's going to make very often. No. You know, that, no. Kind of, that kind of stuff gets whittled away. He's constantly grinding, practicing, showing up to locals, playing online tournaments. Like, he really is constantly grinding in Surely. this game. It's only wow. going to get better. But you're right. For for today, for this week, um, not the best decision to put himself there. Alex took full advantage.
To be fair, I think there was a lot of, of fear instilled by Myers' pressure, all right? In and out of the places where it's like up close, it's very hard to contest against Chun-Li with the amount of normal she could throw out before it's your turn. Uh, even so, the overhead's also very hard to contest. Enter the Hokage was been, or has been uh, getting clipped by a bunch of those. And some of the big moments where Myers had made like really interesting decisions, uh, I think that was just like an error on trying to get drive reversal. I mean, Enzo did capitalize, right, when it was his turn. But like, other than that, I think he did get a little bit antsy mm -hmm. once he didn't have any momentum and he was trying to figure out neutral against Myers, which understandably so. I mean, you're, you're in your last pretty much leg of their, your tournament run. Yeah. The Hawaiian punch is flowing. Mm -hmm. The candles are lit on the wall. You don't know what's coming next. Yeah, look at this series. If you knew it was actually Hawaiian Punch, like legitimately, would you try it? Of course. Wouldn't you? Wouldn't you go no, to the wellspring of eternal Hawaiian Punch?